Hey everybody, it is Monday the 25th of March. This is the weekly vlog. You have to excuse me, I'm covered in spots still. I'm really getting on my nerves. Um, so most of the day is over because I've been packing orders um, that I had, waiting for one to come in, payment, I've got that. I'll be sending that off tomorrow before we go away. Um, oh dear, so there's not a lot happening today. I'm going to uh, try and read a bit more of this, I think. I'm going to do some tea in a minute because it's late. Bought so many book brands. I've had three of them now. I just haven't put all the bookcases up yet because I couldn't be bothered. I'm too tired. Um, starting to pack a few bits for our couple of days away. We're off to Chard in Somerset. Um, there's a bookshop in Chard. I'm actually wanting to go to a bookshop in Langport, but you know I'm going to visit both of them. They've also got lots of charity shops. I love charity shops. Um, so we'll have a good wander around Chard. We're hopefully going to go to Fern Animal, Animal Sanctuary, which is in the area. It'll be a busy couple of days, but it's going to be fun. So I'm going to go downstairs and finish watching some more, because I said we'd take a colouring book with us. I'll be taking my Kindle. I won't be taking any of my physical books, because I'm probably going to buy physical books. At least one from the bookshops. Anyway, I'm going to pop downstairs now, because it's actually tired and I want to crack on. So I'll be seeing you in a little bit. So it's bedtime, and like I said, not a lot's happened today. Um... Obviously, we're going away tomorrow to Somerset. I'm looking forward to it. I might, I don't seem like I am. I know I'm just feeling a bit down. I'm, I'm really missing my dad today. I, I really am. I, I still can't believe he's not here anymore. That he's gone. Um, it's a cold, dark world without him. I don't like it. So, yeah, so tomorrow there'll be a bit more vlogging because we're off. We have a nice long drive. Well, it's not that long, but when we get there, we'll have a wander around. There's a bookshop in Chard. It's only called the Chard Bookshop, but, you know, it's a local independent. And what I want to do is when I go anywhere like this, if there is a small local independent bookshop, I want to show my support by going in and buying maybe a bookmark or a tote bag or even a book. Um... Because they're important. So I'm actually going to take my meds so I can pack my meds and then I'm going to read before bed like I always do. So tired, very very tired. Anyway I'll see you in the morning when we do some more stuff and uh, we'll do some vlogging like on the way and stuff. Yeah, I need this weekend away. I'm looking forward to it. Hello, everybody. Say hello to Jennifer. Hello. We haven't seen you for a long time. No, so we thought we'd say hello today. Where are we? In Burger King. At the service of Bridgewater Services. Because we're on our way to Chard, aren't we? Nah, Watch out for the crocodile. <laughs> yeah, so we thought that we've had something to eat. You enjoyed your Burger King. It's the first Burger King. Well, it's the second one you've had, but you can't remember the first one because you're only really little. There's something inside. Well, yes, don't lose the sweets. There's sweets in there. Oh. There you go. Um, did you like the chicken nuggets in Burger King? Yeah, and fries. Were they nice? Yeah. So there we go. We can take it to Burger King now. It doesn't have to always be McDonald's. Unless we're in uh, Porto de la Cruz. We're going to be moving on out again in a minute, aren't we? Moving on out. On our way to Chard. Yeah. If we don't get eaten by a crocodile first. Yeah. It will give you a tour later, won't we? Yeah. Jennifer loves it. Yeah, I want to live here. It's too small for us to live in, but it's all right for a break. Yeah. It's only two bedrooms, isn't it? I want to see your And there's only a shower, and you don't particularly like showers, but you're going to have one later with Mummy, aren't you? Yeah, because I'm too scared. And they've left us milk, butter, wine, bread. What? Wait, shortbread, we... biscuits, and just... eggs as well. Yes, cheeky chops. Are you looking at your teeth? Yeah, because my teeth look at my used to. I know. So we'll have a cup of tea and then we'll go for a walk around Chard. And no, I will... thank you. Eh? Drink. Yeah, you can have a drink too. And then we will show you around. But I need a cup of tea after all that driving. But we're here. 
we are. Jennifer's messing around on one of these seaty things. Hey. I'm going to have a quick look round. Hey, Found where the bookshop doing? is. What are you doing? Filming. It's the weekly vlog. No, no, no. It's facing you. It's looking at that that way. So we're going to go up there and have a look round, aren't we, Jen? Yeah? Funny. Yeah, top end of the high street, Gordon Paul, who used to live around here years ago. A little water feature here. So they've gone into the sports shop behind me for some reason. I don't know why. But I'm going to go in the bookshop and I'll show you that in a minute. The bookshop is around the corner. It was open. I'm not going. I want to have a look. So we're going around there in a minute. If they ever come out. The bookshop was closed. It closes at 2.30 on a Tuesday for some unfathomable reason. But we'll go another time. So here we are. Shut the door. Are you in, Jen? Yeah. Okay. So first of all, we've got this lovely little sitting room with a log burner and a TV. Yeah. Unfortunately, it has YouTube on it. Yeah, some little books there if you want to read. Here's a kitchen. kitchen. Nice chunk of bread there. Oh, there's, a door. Yeah, Lovely. Um, there's a bottle of wine as well, but in a minute. In the kitchen and then out the back. Take a cup of tea out there if it's not raining. There's a little cupboard here. Boiler. What's the secret door? Hey. It's the cupboard under the stairs, Jen. Yeah, What's the cupboard? It's a cupboard under the stairs. So it goes under the stairs. It's a. Uh, oh. Which keeps a hoover look. That's <laughs> Right, let's go upstairs. Get, get. Oh, we have to buy the blinking towels in the car. Yeah, but not enough because I need one for my hair as well as my body. What towel? Towel for a shower in a minute. Right, let's go and have a look upstairs first. I've got no shoes on. Up we go. I'm going to show you our, um, me and Mummy's bedroom. Because we're sleeping together, aren't we? Yeah, because. There's only two rooms. Yes. Mm. And Daddy snores. Yeah. So we're going to sleep in this one. Yeah. One time. Can you get out of the way? Okay. Hello. Yeah. So I, I, I just want to put my drink there. Okay. It's very nice. Yeah. Um, there's a shower. Yeah, there's a shower. There's a shower. Bathroom. And the other bedroom, which is a really nice room with massive double, lots of storage. Oh, there's plenty of towels, there's more there, good. And uh, they've done it out really nice. You can put your clothes in there. So, are we going to have a shower? Yeah, me too. Alright, okay, so, I'm going to find the charger and put this on charge, and then jump in the shower. Uh, not yet, Jen. Leave it for a minute. God. I've got to be honest, it's not late, but I'm shattered. It's literally about quarter to eight. I think it's from... Oh, it's driving and stuff. I'm just so tired. So I'm going to just play on my phone and read for a bit. I've only got my Kindle. I didn't bring any books. So I've got plenty on my Kindle to read, so I'm just going to sit and... Trying to finish this perfect bookshop murder mystery thing, cosy mystery. And then I've got another one queued up ready to go straight after, which sounds a bit spooky. I'm so tired. Tomorrow we're hoping to go to Fern Animal Sanctuary, I want to say. I can't even say it. Maybe, maybe the beach if we get there early enough. Uh, at the bookshop, I have just... I'm wrecked. Uh, we had fish and chips from Chip Shop. There were so many of them. It was from Lucky's. It was beautiful chips, beautiful fish, but just far too much. And the portion was huge. 
Um, yeah, as you see, because I haven't dried my hair with a hair dryer, it's a little bit on the curly side, which is what happens. So I'm just going to read for a bit, and I'll see you tomorrow morning, because I will probably be going to sleep soon. Wednesday morning, and we're going to go to the Fern Animal Sanctuary, aren't we, and have a look at the animals, hopefully. Yeah? It's yeah. just Jennifer. And then we'll see what time we get back. The bookshop's open until half three today and tomorrow. So we'll either try and do it yeah, this afternoon yeah. or tomorrow morning before we leave. Oh, she's got a tattoo thing out of a packet of candy sticks, which back in my day had a red end and were called candy cigarettes, but now they're just white sticks. But there you go. I am old. Stop okay. that, doing that. Anyway, let's go see some yes, animals. We're at Fern, Park, Fern Animal Sanctuary. We've just had to go on the wishing well because Jennifer's wanted to go on a wishing well for ages. There's one of the ponds. So th there's a pond. You can cross ponds off. Yeah. Pond. Pond. There you go. That's the pond. So cross it off. We will in a bit. Where is it? On the list. Come on, let's have a sit down and we'll mark it off. Pond. Hey, it's Daddy. There you go, you having fun? He's now playing on the play stuff, she's pretty happy. It's quite nippy, although it has warmed up a bit. Um, she did it, oh well done Jen! So she's climbing on the climbing, I'll show you in a minute. She's off, Nana and a boo boo, here we go. I'm just chilling, it's really nice. You can if you want. Like abseiling. You're stuck, na 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 boo boo. Oh, she's funny. Oh. And we're gonna go in and have a look. Mm. We got some second hand ones, how cool. Did you find a book? Hey Jen. So say you unicorn that you got at Fern Sanctuary. And his name is Pinky because he's got a pink mane and tail and a pink horn. And where's Chicky? And this is Red. Her, her little key ring. Mm, they're babies, aren't they? We are now in a pub called the Wind Whistle Inn. It sings Cricket St Thomas, New Child. If you remember those adverts from the 80s and 90s, fair play to you. And we're going to have, Jennifer's having sausage, beans and chips, aren't you? And me and Paul are going to have the midweek carvery and see what it's like. I am looking forward to this. I am so loving, I love food. We did buy a book for Jennifer and a book for Mummy in the bookshop. And I'll show you those when we get home, back to the cottage later. Oh, so, what if, what if we can read it to the fans? No, we'll read it to each other. We don't read books to the fans because it's copyrighted material. So, um, I can't remember what book I got, but it looks good. And Jennifer got a good book, didn't you? Yeah, you got lots today. You got your ah. unicorn and your thing and a book. I don't know. She gets so much stuff. How do you feel? Uh, it's all familiar, but the house is completely different. Which, which house was it? This one? It used to be a bungalow, didn't it? It used to be a bungalow. We really invested onto that one, obviously. Yeah. Uh, that's that's nice. You have conifers up front. Well, yeah, you said there were. Uh, so this is where Paul used to live till he was about, what, 13? Yeah. 
fields are still there. Yeah. <laughs> we're not stopping on, we just came to have a look. Because uh, we went to Cornwall once and yeah. to, uh, we went to the Eden Project and we drove through a small village called Stenelees. And I kind of freaked out because I lived there. So we've always said we'd come back down to Charles so that Paul could see where he lived. And we're going to pop now down to, was it, Tatworth? Yes, if you're down this road, what, we just we're going, going right. Go so left. Go left, so we yeah. go through Tatworth. All right, we're going to find somewhere to, to turn around. Uh, we're going to go see where he went to school. Thursday morning, and it's time to leave Cozy Cottage, isn't it? Somebody's in a funny mood this morning. She had to take her car sickness meds, and she's uh, going to go and get her glasses, which are back in Risca, which we will go and get, don't panic. Chicken. <laughs> it's the little things, isn't it? She loves it. Mm. Mm. Alright, shall we go? Mm, yeah. Good girl. Say hi. Hi. Snug Bookshop and Cafe in Langport. Snug Bookshop is on TikTok. I am so excited <laughs> to be here. Let's go in. Good Friday. I uh, didn't vlog yesterday. We all absolutely knackered when we got back so i bought one book in the snug bookshop i bought lupita may's the lewis man now i haven't got the first one in the series because it's a three book series but that's okay i will get that when i can it's no big rush because i've got so many other books to read so i bought two books for me all together on the weekend which was the alberton angels and the lewis man and jennifer got three books she got a horse called now oi cat and oi dog so she was very lucky she got Spoil. I don't mind buying her books. Books are cool. I had a long chat with Sam in the snug, um, who owns it. She's on TikTok. We talked for ages about books, authors. Um, she's quite near Glastonbury, so the Glastonbury Festival, celebrities, Johnny Depp. Um, he yelled James, who was a friend of hers. Um, and all sorts of other things. We were in there for a good hour, having a good chat before we got home. Popped in to see mum. She's okay. She's getting up more now. Um, she had an off day the other day. Uh, it's all good. She's got carers coming in. She doesn't... It's not that she doesn't want them to help her. She does, but she didn't feel like certain things. So tomorrow she's going to ha have a good wash with them. They did brush her hair. Um, Chris is going to get medication put on their care plan because they can add it. And then Tuesday we've got the people coming out to put to rise the bed so it's higher for her um because it's quite low down so it makes it harder for her to get up it makes sound weird but it is and to put some bars in the toilet so it's easier for her to pull herself up when she's been to the bathroom so it's all looking good i have got two sales to post even though it's good friday i will get them ready and take them down to the shop get them in the system they can go first thing tomorrow it's no problem and yes i'm fine uh been tidying up a bit, sorting out some of my colouring supplies because you know I've got too many. Nah, nah. And when I got up this morning, the sun was shining, it was beautiful, and now it's hammering down. It's just typical British springtime weather, unfortunately. So I'm going to get dressed, pop down to see mum, get my laptop, print those labels out before I pack it away because I might as well because it's there. Go up the shed to get them. Yeah, I'm trying to sort stuff out. It's all good. We'll get there. Yeah, so I'm going to crack on and get over to mum's. It's still lunchtime. I'm trying to find a pair of clean trousers because we're going to go down the park and meet up with Jennifer's friend, Quinn, and my friend Hazel. Um, so I'm going to have to quickly very look for some clothes and shoot off. So yeah, it'd be really nice to see uh, Quinn and Hazel. Um, but yeah, there's clothes everywhere because there's always a ton of washing in this house, obviously. Um, but I'm just trying to find something for me to wear. So... I'll see you down the park. We did go to the park. I didn't film down there. There were just too many kids around. And I don't feel comfortable feeling, filming other people's kids um, without their permission. So we went to the park for a while. Then we went to the pub. Then we came home. Read a bit in the garden. I finished Spy by Danielle Steele. Pulled another one from the TBR jar, which is S.J. Kincaid's uh, The Diabolique, which I haven't read yet, or The Diabolic. I haven't read it yet. I've had it since it came out, almost. I bought some of those electronic counting money jars from TikTok shop. I got two, and I'm because I've got I save a lot of pennies and my shrapnel change, 
and I filled up one with pennies and it's got £15 in pennies in it so now I'm actually old in pennies. Um, I did have two, I gave the other one to Jennifer and we put some of her money in it and we're going to put the rest of hers in tomorrow. I've ordered some more um, for the rest of my change as at the moment my, well not my ones, but my twos, fives, tens and twenties are all mixed up. Um, I tend to save all that change and I don't cash it in. I save fifties pounds and two pounds but I use those when we go on holiday most of the time so what I'm going to do is I'm going to sort it all out get it all sorted um, see how much there is and I might cash it in and put it in the bank it would be better but I find that if it's in the bank I'll spend it let's be honest yeah no I, I don't do a lot but hello everybody it's Easter Sunday we've had Easter eggs haven't we Jen um, we've had Nanny Sally come round we're going to go around and see Nana and depending on what the weather does I'll decide what we're doing later. Watch a bit Doctor Who. She's obsessed. She's moved on now. She's not into David Tennant anymore. She likes John Sim as the master. I like John Sim as the master. I thought he was brilliant. And you can, you know, there's one more episode with John Sim in as the master. There's an episode with the Miss, Missy in it as well. So you've got two masters. The female one and the male one. I'll try and find that one for you. All right, when we get to Nana's, because it's... I can't remember what series is in, I watched it once. Anyway, we're going to go now. Oh, the pub. Kids are off doing an Easter egg hunt, I think, probably. Yeah. So, I'm just having a few drinks. Barbecue later. Yay! I didn't do much filming and to be honest when I got home it was gone six I had a bit of a breakdown and couldn't stop crying for my dad oh, so I'm gonna knock this one on the head <coughs> and I probably won't do any thing talk next week vlogging wise I'm gonna try and do um, a colouring video with Jen but yeah I just had a bit of a breakdown couldn't stop crying for a good hour so it was nice up there but there's nothing else I can say anyway I hope you had a lovely Easter and I will see you all soon I promise <laughs>